Uh, shalom, shalom, giving all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rekakodash. All right, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who rule well. All right, worthy to be accounted double honors for teaching us his truth. And peace and salutation to why you all came out there preaching this truth throughout the four corners of the earth for truth and sincerity in your hearts mm -hmm. for the love of the gospel. All right, Shalom. This is uh, Indiana, GMS Indiana coming with you know, to sit down. All mm -hmm. right, uh, um, I'm uh, Shamaria. Uh, I'm Shamaria, y'all Shalom. Come on. All right. And we coming with another father, son, sit down. All right, but uh, this sit down is going to be about uh, uh, the, the people that were, the people that were supposed to be teaching, man. They hate us, you know, the people that we're supposed to be enlightening, all right, the people that that needs uh that needs salvation, all right, the um the ones that the two thirds of our nation that need salvation, they hate us, you know, but it's prophesied, you know, and that's what we're gonna get into. We're gonna get into the prophecies of the people being hate us. So if you hate it, and if you're a prophet and you're going through turmoil about people hating you, then just know that it's written. All right, this is Amos five, verse ten. It says, they hate him that rebuketh in the gate, mm -hmm. and they abhor him that speak up uprightly. All right? They hate him that rebuketh in the gate. Why is that? Why do they hate him that rebuketh in the gate? The scriptures talk about the, they hate the light. All right? At least their evil deeds will be reproved. See, these people, evil evil deeds is their sin. All right? They, they, they hate the light because they don't want to uh, correct their evil ways. You know, let me get that real quick. I, think I, got, uh, I got some. This is uh Saint John. Looks like him. This is yeah. This is Saint John, fifteen and eighteen. He said, um, all okay. kind. Uh, this, yeah, this is Saint John. I'm gonna start at fifteen. I'm gonna start at uh. Uh, I'm gonna start at 16 because this is what he ordained us, man. You said 15. You know, yeah, I'm gonna start at 15, 15 and 16. Uh, he said, "Ye have not chosen me, but I have." Saint John 15, what? 15 and 16. Oh, 15 and 16. Yeah. Now, uh, yeah, because Yahweh Shah commissioned us, man, to do a work, and you know, he said that's what the scripture says. You know, many are called, few are chosen. Okay. Now it might be a lot of men that's called. You know what I'm saying? But his chosen are actually going to be the ones that's out here really doing the work that he uh, set before them. All right. Um, you got church pastors, man, that they, 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 they think they're called. OK, but guess what? They got to do that. They got to do their part. They may have been called, they, but he, he, he's he look, the most high is, is cold with it, man. He can deceive. We were just talking about this last night with uh, brother. Your call came in town uh, and now. And, you know, the Lord can, can, can mess your, you know, that's why you got to always, as it says, the scripture says, man, prove yourselves, your own selves, whether you be in the faith. Okay. Walk accordingly, man. Make sure you're walking according to what the scripture says and not to your own, uh, your own understanding. Leave not to your own understanding. All right. Because this work is basically the most important thing. All right. And like I said, charity to your brothers, man. And really, basically, your guideline is the scriptures. All right, I'm going to start off with um, St. John 15 and 16. You have not chosen me, but I have chosen you and ordained you that ye should go and, and bring forth fruit and that your fruit should remain that, wh whos that whatsoever ye shall ask of, my, of the Father in my name, he may give it you. Mm -hmm. These things I command you that ye love one another, that the world hated you, Ye know that it hated me before it hated you. Okay. So that's the only that's the only given thing, man. So we man, we're not looking for no love of this world, man. Fuck this place, man. You know, I I I, I strive. I pray. I was telling uh, brothers, man. I I pray. You know, because I I found myself murmuring. You know, dang, I I pray and I got a good, I got a decent job, man. I'm able to do things, pay my bill, and I'll be murmuring. Dang, I ain't never got a day off. I had to like down there slap myself I'm like man shut the fuck up what are you talking about you 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 the bill came but you can pay the bill mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying okay you don't have the time to do what you need to do hey man but they do what you got to do press towards the mark man go to work do what you have to do and push this word you know what i'm saying we supposed to be fucking working man you know and if you're a blessing man to be able to help other brothers man that that's that's a hey, the scripture says what man uh prophet 
don't have a quarterback. Prophet's award. Oh, he that he that receive a prophet so you get a prophet's reward. Yeah, prophet's reward, man. But so look, man, doing this work, man, your whole shy is gonna reward you. You mm -hmm. yo 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 treasures is being set up in heaven. Okay. All right, so your whole shy got your back, man. Okay. All right, of course. Yeah, um, precept to that that John. All right, let me go back to it. Read it over. It says John fifteen. All right, verse eighteen. If the world hate you, ye you know that it hated me before it hated you. Mm -hmm. All right. Verse 19. Well, yeah, I was just going to say, go ahead and read 19. If ye were of the world, the world would love its own. Mm -hmm. But because ye are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hates you. Right. Right. That's why these church pastors have such a huge followings, man. They, I mean, these mega churches, man. Uh, uh, what's his name? Uh, the, the fucking uh, Edomite. Oh, all of these churches. No, shit, but basically, man. all of them. All yeah. of them. Because, you know, it, according to where they at, they, those are huge followers. These these pastors, they, these churches make millions, man. They make a lot of money. Even the small time church, small man. time church, you know, yeah. Like my it, church is a, uh, you got something called a co a Kojic church, yeah. You know, and they got yeah. their whole denomination, like they got their own denomination. Came up with their own denomination. They got a lot of followers. No, no, man. they they up under the Catholic Church. They, Kojic is a is, is 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 a denomination. Up falls up under uh, what's the name, and it, it's all that's if you. Well, they don't consider themselves Catholic at all. I mean, no, I, I no, know. they that they not Catholic, but the cat, all of it reigns up under. It's like a, uh, it's a, uh, it's a order. It's but a they, order. They get to do what they want to. They get to do up under that banner, but it flies up under the, the, the Catholic Church. Has to is the overseer of all these, these uh, so called churches. They're overseers, but they don't have to follow that the Catholic doctrine. Yeah, that's what I'm. Right. Uh, yeah, that, I mean, they, they 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 separate themselves from being right. Catholic. Right. But all of that shit is bullshit, you know. Right. Because I mean, what I was saying was like they got all of these denominations, but they come up. These people can come up with their own denomination, mm -hmm. and then they get this mass amount of followers. How? Because they all love the world, right. you know. Because the Lord, the world love its own. And if you look back in time, man, all through the scriptures, it gives many examples where the Lord was not dealing with a big number. Mm -hmm. All right, the Lord would never dealt with big numbers. All right, but it said uh. Uh, precept to that, you know, the Lord said, uh, if, if they hate me, you know, if they hate you, then they have hated me before you. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 10, verse 22. It says, it says, and ye shall be hated of all men for my name's sake, but the he that endureth to the end shall be saved. Why does it say that? Because the Lord has to test, he has to test you, man. Mm -hmm. He got to see, he got to prove you and see if you're worth, if you're worth it. You know, just like how you got to prove gold, all right? We got to right. go through this. We got to go through this hell to get refined, man. All these impurities got to be burnt off of us, all right? Verse 23, it says, but when they, it says, but when they persecute you in the, in this city, flee into another. For verily I say unto you, ye shall not have gone over the cities of Israel till the sons of men be come. And that's the same thing we're going to have to do when they persecute us on this time, man. When they come and persecute us in this city, you're supposed to flee to another one, man. That's right. That's you right. know, whether well, you got to go to another city, it don't literally mean go to another city, but you can go to the woods, wherever you got to go to escape persecution. That's right. All right. Now, right. some of us not going to be able to escape, yeah. you know. So, this is verse 24. It says, the disciple is not above his master, nor the servant above his Lord. All right. So, if they hated the Lord. Then they got to hate us, too, because we're servants of Yahweh Bashem Yahusha, and they spat right. on him. They whipped him. Right. All right. They gave him vinegar to drink. They tortured him by crucifixion. <laughs> so, you know. You know, that's so funny because that's what the churches escape. Like you, like you were saying earlier, that these churches come up with their own denomination. But that's because mm -hmm. that's something that they came up with. Mm -hmm. They come up with prosperity teaching. Nowhere in the scriptures, the Yahweh Shah taught about prosperity. Mm -hmm. When he said, I have your soul, your soul to prosper, he was meaning in this truth, man, in, this, in, the, in the truth. Not yeah. not uh, financially. He said, man, require that daily bread, man. That's why he put the scripture in the uh, man think gain is godliness. Yeah. Because that's the things of this world. But they, they, they totally skip what you just read, man. Yeah. Matter of fact, I'm, I'm at the same thing. This Because it says the same thing. Were you in Matthew? Uh, yeah, that was Matthew's yeah. 10. And it's, and it's John. Because he reiterates it. This is uh, 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 St. John 15 and 20. Remember the words that I said unto you. The servant is not greater than his Lord. If they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you. Okay, okay so that persecution is, but why ain't churches talking about, hey, hey, you know, what they say, uh, 
they the churches that got commercialized, man. They they like, don't worry about nobody hating on you because God blessed you. No, man. That, that that where the hell that shit come from? That shit come out their own belly. That's your, yeah, that shit shit they, they created out their own belly. No, Jake is persecuted alike. Even them niggas in them churches, man, they think that they they got them they got their finance, man, because they can try to pay because they can pay their bills. But guess what? They still get persecuted. Because who's the great persecutor? Esau. And they Esau pers still yeah. got their ass, man. True. And they and the and the, the bigger per persecution is what? You under the damn curses, nigga. Yep. You ain't getting away from that. Nope. Them curses go is on your ass, man. They own Jake, man. All right, he said persecute you if they have kept he said he said he said the Lord he said if they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you, which is coming. If they have kept my sayings, if we kept these sayings, because we have been we you can see us being persecuted. You can see the persecution of, of the camps out there, man. They they just put 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 throughout the order. Uh you gotta have a thousand followers uh, to put up a, a live video. You got, we got, we got, uh, they passed the order a couple of years back, man. There's a, some type of uh, dignitary coming to your city. You can't go out, you can't be out on a protest. Mm -hmm. Okay. All type of persecution coming towards us, man. Ain't nothing coming against them. Now, now judgment of the, how about some y'all shots coming against these churches? You motherfuckers getting gunned down. You, you ain't safe in them motherfuckers no more. It's just not safe on the streets. Cause you, you went and had these buildings to be safe, man. All right. He said, "If they kept, if they kept my sayings, they will keep your. They will, they will keep a slacker, a slacker. He said, "If they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you. If they have kept my sayings, they will keep your yours also. But these, but all these things, will they do unto you for my name's sake? Because they have known, they have not, they have known not him that sent me." Right, because they don't know Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, man. All right? Yahweh Bashim Yahushai is only sick. He only sent his men, man. All right? Go ahead. John, this is uh, going to the book of Luke, mm -hmm. chapter 6, verse 22. Blessed are ye. All right. Uh, John, it says, blessed are ye when men shall hate you, when, th when they shall speak. When they shall separate you from their company and shall reproach you and cast out your name as evil mm -hmm. for the son of man's sake, rejoice ye in the day and leap for joy. For behold, the reward is great in heaven. All right. For in for in the like manner did their fathers unto the prophets. See, mm -hmm. hey, let me get an example of that real quick. Because it said in like manner, uh, in like manner, what? In like manner did their fathers before the prophets, see? So in like manner, it happened in the days of old as well. People, you know, this ain't nothing new, man. Ever since the beginning of time. It's the book of 1 Kings. 1 Kings 22. Now I started 17. Mm-hmm. Kind All right. Hey, Bob. Uh, a prelude to this is a uh, the king of Judah, Joseph, had came to the king of Israel at the time, all right, which is Ahab. And he says, is there not a prophet of the Lord that we can acquire of? And the wicked king of Ahab said, there is, but I hate him because he only prophesied evil unto me, all right, because he was wicked. And, and because of he prophesied the name, he prophesied in the name of the Lord the truth, they threw him in prison, all right? All right, uh, now I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get what he said, what the Lord told him to say, all right? And then I'm going to get the uh, the reaction of that. Because they hate him, they rebuke it in the gate. Kings 22 and 18. And the king of Israel said unto Jehoshaphat, Did not I tell thee that the, that he would prophesy no good concerning me but evil? And he said, Hear thou therefore the word of the Lord. I, I saw the Lord sitting on his throne and all the host of heaven standing by him on his right hand and on his left. And the Lord said, Who shall, who shall, per, who shall persuade Ahab, which is the king of Israel at that time, Ahab, uh, that who who shall persuade Ahab that he may go up and fall at Ramoth Gilead? See, the Lord is asking the host of heaven, who shall go up and persuade him to fall? All right, so the Lord setting up his failure. Mm -hmm. You know, it says, and one and one said on his on this matter, and the other said on that matter, 
And there came forth a spirit and stood before the Lord and said, I will persuade him. And the Lord said unto him, wherewith? Basically right. meaning how? How are you going to persuade him? Right. He said, wherewith? And he said, I will go forth and I will be a lying spirit in the mouth of all his prophets. And he said, thou shalt persuade him and prevail also. Go forth and do so. Right. All right. So he uh, so the Lord put a lying spirit in the mouth of his prophets because right. they was all wicked, man. Right. right. He on. had a bunch of yes men around him. And that's yep. the same thing you pastors got, man. And everybody else is lying, telling different doctrines. Yeah, you oh, righteous Shalom. Uh, right. All you niggas, man. Yeah. It says uh, now, therefore, behold, the Lord have. Keep in mind that our prophet, the prophet Micah is telling the king of Israel this. He's telling the king of Israel, all your prophets are lying to you and you're going to go up there and you're going to die. All right. So let me keep going. It says, Now, therefore, behold, the Lord have put a lying spirit in the mouth of all these thine prophets, and the Lord have spoken evil concerning thee. But Zedekiah, the son of Chedorah, <coughs> went near and smote Micah on the cheek. See, mm -hmm. Micah was the one talking. God. So he smote him on the cheek. He slapped him. He hit him. It says, And said, Which way went the spirit of the Lord from me to speak to thee? So he got mad. was like, I'm a prophet too. Why did that same spirit come to me and speak it? So he, he slacked him because he was because uh, he was prophesying, man. It says, And Micah said, Behold, thou shalt see in that day when thou shalt go into an inner chamber to hide thyself. Mm -hmm. So he told him, basically, uh, you're going to see when that spirit at when in the day that when they on your ass. When you go in that chamber to hide thyself, you're going to know that I was telling the truth. All right. It says, And the king of Israel said, Take Micah and carry him back into Anon, the governor of the city, to Joash, the king's son, and say, Thus saith the king, put this fellow into prison and, f and feed him with the bread of affliction, with the water of affliction, until mm -hmm. I come in peace. Right. All right? And the, and the king of Israel threw that prophet in prison because he spoke the words of the Lord, man. Right. And that's the same thing that's going to happen to us. That's right. You know? That's right. And uh, we go back up. He said he put a lying spirit in all the mouth of his prophets. He brought 400 prophets to the gate. <laughs> he brought 400 of them to the gate just to have a couple yes men. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know? Damn. And then this crazy thing, because Jehoshaphat was righteous at the time. I know he, he was righteous his entire life, but Jehoshaphat was righteous. All right. That's back when Judah was righteous and Israel was wicked. Mm -hmm. All right. With Israel being the 10 tribes and then Judah being the three tribes. All right. And then uh, Jehoshaphat asked them once, he said, is there a prophet that we can acquire of the Lord? And then he brought 400 men to the gate to prophesy. All right, then he asked him again, okay, I, I hear what you're saying, but is there another prophet? Because he knew them niggas was wicked. He said, man, I've never seen a prophet. Uh, why do you have to call 400 of them? Yeah. He only have, yeah. If he was a real man of the Lord, all you need was one. All you need is one, right? Man. Or Cause two, because yeah. sometimes prophets will have yeah, companies. Yeah, yeah. 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 And, and, and that's the scripture. Yeah. Like you told your brother, you know what I'm saying? He said, because I was proud. Uh, out of mouth of uh, out of mouth of two or three witnesses. Yep. You know, so the scriptures are always gonna back up everything in action too. Yep. All right. And let me let me read this. Uh, the the, the uh, to, um, this is a uh, Sirach. Um, to um, to back up what you're saying. Okay. This is Sirach. Uh, forty-two. Uh, I'm gonna start at fifteen. Cause man, everything we have to always consider that this is the Lord's program, man. We're just that, we're just part of we're just part of what he his plan. You know, and if we adhere to him, that's that's part of his plan. All right. He said, I will now remember. This is Sirach. Um, he said, time. I will now remember the works of the Lord and uh, and declare the things that I have seen in the in the words of the Lord. See, are are his works, the things that's in it, because the things that Yahweh shall want us to do are in his word. All right. Verse 16, the sun that giveth light looketh upon all things. And the works thereof is full of, of, his, of the glory of the Lord. The Lord hath given power to the saints to declare all his marvelous works, which the almighty Lord for, uh, firmly settled, that whatsoever is mighty be, that so ever is mighty be established for his glory. All right, the promise is there for his glory only. Yeah. That's where everything works together for the good, man. If you a wicked nigga, you are working together for Yahweh Shah's glory. Well, These yeah. niggas out here is doing all this, this, all this, the fucking, all this scoffing. Mm -hmm. Them niggas is there for a reason, man. Yep. Everybody got a role to play, man. Yep. All right. Hey, uh, uh, oh, the, say the uh, you can do no, you can do nothing against the truth before yeah, the truth, time, man. Yeah, because the, the Lord's spirit is the Lord will pour 
his spirit upon all flesh. Hey, he right. got evil spirits and hey, righteous spirits. Hey, do he not do he not got Esau bring it out true? Yep. Bro, I was just watching the dude uh, go in depth more about uh uh Martin Luther King, not just uh the one where they said he smothered him, but he went in depth even more saying that the dude that the, the doctor, the head doctor that was uh over over autopsy, him, yeah. he over the autopsy, the son of the the the, the uh, mafia man's son. Well, he was the same doctor and the mafia man. It was, it was, it was all arranged that if that bullet didn't kill Martin, uh, kill King, uh, Martin Luther King, that he was supposed to go to that hospital. And the doctor declared that same doctor that, that told him to let him die. He was the doctor of a mobster, mm -hmm. and the mobster's son was fifteen at the time and overheard him saying, "If he don't die, that bullet don't kill him. Bring him to this hospital. We'll make sure he don't leave up out of there." Okay. And that's that's the second witness. The first witness was the nurse. Yeah. That the, the black nurse that they put out, her son heard his mother tell him. Mm -hmm. So, hey, again, the, the scriptures out of mouth of two or three witnesses, which really that don't matter. But what I'm saying is that um uh all this stuff is 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 the truth is the scripture says he applied his uh uh spirit on all flesh. Right. Truth is, is 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 at its all time high right now, yep. man. Anything you want to know, I, I I talk to people at my job. I'm like anything you want to know is, is it's on YouTube. It's on it's on Google. It's on the internet. Yeah. It's on the internet. Even us, we're on the internet. So yeah. truth is is flooded night right now, man. You get salvation through the internet. Yeah, yeah bro. Yeah, cause hey, cause why? Cause hey, man, that's that horn, man. Y'all wish I set that up, man. Yep. It said, that's uh, why Esau can't shut it down. It said knowledge shall increase. That's right. That's right. You listen to that? No, yeah, that was it. Um, well, let me, it was a little bit more. Let me see. Okay. Uh, he said the Lord hath given power to his saints to declare all. All his marvelous works, which the uh, Almighty will firmly settle, right? Which he will settle, right? With what? With thermonuclear destruction. That whosoever is mighty, this whoever who might be established for his glory. Verse 18, he seeketh out the deep, and the, he, he seeketh out the deep in the heart, and considereth mm -hmm. the crafty devices for their Lord. For um, He said, the crafty devices for the Lord knoweth all. They that may that be known, and he he beholdeth the signs. Forget my reading, man. I ain't got my glasses on. Okay, I got and you. he below beholdeth the signs of the world. It says, For the Lord knoweth all that may be known. <laughs> man. So he knoweth all everything, all. everything, all, all the information on the face That's of the right. earth. He That's knows right. everything. That's right. And so then it's, so uh, it ain't nothing you can uh fake or do or in seek aid. Because in John, he said, What? He said, I, 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 um, go ahead, go ahead and read that, and I'll find it. Uh, it says, uh, and he beholdeth the signs of the world. See, because he created the signs of the world. He, he created all the signs of the world, man. All right. Because it said the moon, the stars, all right, the greater light and the lesser light. All right. They said, they said, these are all should be for signs, you know, in times. He created the signs of the world. The prophecies are signs, you know. He created all of that, you know. All knowledge belongs to him. Secret. What you looking for? Pull it. You got it. Where is it? Okay, this is uh. Yeah, five percent. So. Okay, this is uh. Okay, this is uh. This is Saint John eighteen and twenty. He said. He said, Yahweh Shai answered him, I spake openly to the world. I ever taught in the synagogues and in the temple. Rather, the Jews always resort, and in secret have I said nothing. Yep. Man, <laughs> he said, "What I reveal, to, what I reveal to you in dark, you shall uh, shout upon the shout rooftops. upon the rooftops, man." Right? Yeah. Because why did he give reveal it in the dark? He really to his prophets, his, his service to prophets, man. Yeah. He telling us in secret, man, and we're to pro go, go proclaim it. All right, so man, so all that, that's why that that secret society and all that bullshit, that shit, why we blew blow the cap off that shit, man. And and Jake be thinking he knows something. Like, yeah, I know about the Illuminati. Get nigga, get shut the fuck up. Shut up! That, that's you, you. You ain't even scratching the surface. You, you. Hey, Jake, no wickedness. That's it. That's right. All right. That's 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 it, man. All right. With that, we give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, and All right. Double honor to the apostles and elders, a great millstone who rule well. And peace and salutation to all you all keep preaching the truth throughout the four corners of the earth mm -hmm. with your sincerity. Hope this video is edifying through the spirit and the power. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Till next time, we'll say Shalom. Shalom.